All right, guys, welcome to a different kind of video today. We're going to be going over how to install the new Direwolf 20 uh, mod pack so you guys can go ahead and play it. Uh, so you're going to go ahead and go to this link here. Link will be down in the description, so you just go ahead and click that. Then you're going to be presented with this screen. So we're going to go ahead and hit the Windows download because I'm on Windows. Going to go ahead and run this application here. It's going to be over with. Don't worry about it. All right. And then once you do go through all the install stuff you see, you'll have an option pop up like this. You're going to go ahead and hit the FTB app here. You'll get this screen. Then once this is all loaded, I've already got the pack installed, but where you go ahead and go get it installed, you go to Browse, and normally it'll be here. Otherwise, you can just type in Direwolf20 up here. Yeah, and then it pops up. There you go, and you can go ahead and install it there. So you just hit get, you let it install, and then if you guys want to install Optifine as well, all you're going to go ahead and do is you're going to go to My Mod Packs after it's installed. You're going to hit More. You're going to go ahead, Open Folder. You're going to go ahead and have the page pop up. You're going to select on Mods, and then you're going to go ahead and download Optifine 1.16.4, and you're going to drag it into this folder here, and then it'll be installed for you. All right, we come here to optifine.net and then we go to download we hit mirror I do have an ad blocker so it should just pop up over here exit out of that keep all right and then we go ahead and load up our mods folder here and then we take this once it's down done downloading or finalizing and then we just drag it over and there we go optifine is now in the direwolf 20 pack all right, and then to allocate more RAM, uh, we're going to go ahead and go into My Mod Packs here. You're going to hit on More. Then you're going to go over here to Settings. You're going to scroll down a little bit. You're going to crank this up to where you seem fit. I can go all the way up to like 31, but I'm just going to leave it around 12. And then you hit Save down at the bottom, and you're all good to go. All you hit now is hit Play. Wait, wait for this thing to load, and you're good to go. Then all you have to do is wait for it to load up. It's a little bit different. You'll see it uh, kind of kind of load through the launcher itself and not through like another window and voila it'll just pop up out of nowhere and you're good to go go ahead and hit the, the full screen single player and you're good to go all right guys that's gonna wrap up the episode i hope this was helpful for you guys who didn't know how to install the new direwolf 20 pack if you guys have any other questions please feel free to post them down in the comment section i'll, I'll make sure to try to answer them or someone else will answer them but anyways guys I hope you have a great rest of the day take care Bye -bye.